I'm talking about working with Excel. Let's say you're doing an annual report. This is in design. You need to put a chart. You may need to be put in part of the spreadsheet. I'm going to show you that. We have the spreadsheet here. We need to put in both the top and the bottom area. We have a chart here. I'm going to click on this. I'm going to copy. We all know how to copy. You can copy and just paste it in here. And we move it. And then if you want to make it larger, hold Control Shift. We're making it the width of the page. So we've got that. If we want to look better, you can right click in here. You can say display performance, say high quality. It looks a lot better. It will suck down some of your RAM. Okay, let's look at this spreadsheet for a second. You're only using cells A1 through A5. You have to know the range that you're pasting in here. And you may have to write a couple of notes here. You're not just going to copy and paste. You're going to be doing it through the file place or control D. There's three sheets in here. We don't want the workbook open. It won't work. I'm going to close out of it. Okay. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to file place control D. I'm going to say show import options. We browse for the file. We see chart. Double click on it. It's showing the cells. I want to just select B1 through B5. It's going to come through as a formatted table. And we say, OK, put the mouse in here. We've got it. If you see the borders there, it's really big. This is so easy to fix. You right click inside here. You click on fitting, fit frame to contact. Content. If you want to make it bigger, go in the corner, control, shift, drag. You got the information in there this is not linked if you were to say you now sold 600 pants not 500 you're gonna still have that showing in there